hello everybody welcome to my channel i'm in my craft room uh working on some ufos and i had the brilliant idea of bringing you along with me as i work on them just as something different i thought i have quite a few to get through and as most of you know i'm doing the handmade christmas this year so everything except for socks is handmade <laughs> All the kids' presents, Wayne's presents, everybody we give gifts to are getting handmade gifts this year or partially handmade gifts because some bits I do have to, you know, buy. But the other thing I'm doing is shopping from my stash. <laughs> I have quite a stash, I've come to realise. So I've got a few projects that I want to get done tonight. So I thought, seeing I'm in the craft room, you might like to join me and craft along with me. I might be able to inspire you. Or if you've got a great idea for me, drop it in the comments below because I would love, love, love a good idea. The first thing on my list tonight, and there's a few things, is this little coin purse. Just a little simple coin purse, but it's got a clip on it so that it can clip inside my handbag and this is where I am going to keep my trolley coin because I keep losing trolley coins they get I don't know where they go but they disappear I put one in my purse and it disappears I put one in the console of the car it disappears so this nifty little um, coin purse is going to be the trolley coin purse so that's my first project and I want to get it out of the way it's been sitting in the craft room for a couple of months waiting for me to do something with it I want to put my um, initials on it I'm going to monogram it now what I'm doing is just wiping it I'll do both sides um, wiping it with an alcohol wipe they're just two dollar shop alcohol wipes uh, just to take any dust or, or grease or anything that might have got onto it, onto the surface, off it. While it's drying, I'm going to weed this cute little piece. This is so sweet. I don't know if you can see it or not. My big finger might be in the way. So sweet. Rose gold. Isn't it gorgeous? So I've just, it was a scrap that I didn't throw out. So I thought it will look so pretty on the black and I just love the rose gold. Really, really love it. Um, such a pretty, pretty colour. There we go. And then take the middle out of the A before I forget. Okay. And I could probably try and rescue that, but I won't. Um, now, I know it is going to fit, but I am going to trim it down so that I've got a better idea of how it fits because it's a, a teeny tiny little surface I'm working on. Okay, there we go. I think that's going to look so nice and everybody will know it's mine. There will be no mistakes. All right, I will use transfer paper because it is quite big. I reuse my transfer paper, my transfer tape. Actually, this is, I don't have transfer paper. I have transfer tape. There's my scraper. Um, I'm nearly to the end of my first roll. And that's not too bad for, we've had the scan and cut just over two years. So that's not too bad. It looks like it's all stuck. Let's see if it's going to lift off. Yes, 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 yes. Yay. Okay. Now I will put it, try and get it on without sticking it down. Oh, this is going to look so pretty. So, so pretty. And that looks about centered okay Put it on Let's 
see if it's going to stick. Now, this this roll of rose oil, rose gold. For ah, oh, that's so pretty. I am loving that. Can you see that? No, you can't see it. Ah, oh, it's so pretty. That's going to look so nice in my handbag. I will feel special. All right, one project down. 1100 to go, as the kids used to say. Oh, oh, that's going to look so nice. Nobody will be able to say it's theirs. Now, the next project, still on Scan and Cut, most of Charlotte's projects are Scan and Cut projects, is this notebook. This is part of my Christmas um, Christmas box idea. It's just a pretty notebook. It is from Kmart. It was oh, $2, $2.50. I bought it at the beginning of the year in the back to school sales before they were back to school sales because I loved it. I have someone in mind for it, someone who just loves butterflies. But I thought I would put this on the front and it says create something new every day because we all need something nice, something fun to do. I like to create things and the person I have in mind for this does too. So I've already cut the transfer tape. It's just, just about the right size. I just need to trim a bit off the bottom. It's much easier um, if your transfer tape isn't too big. Trust me when I say this. So I'm going to trim a bit off the bottom. Here's my big scissors. Big, big scissors. These scissors were actually um, the freebies from the Coles when they were doing the kitchen tools or whatever it was um, earlier this year, late last year. Okay, now let me try and roll this back the other way so that it won't curl up on me. There we go. All right. Move that out of the way. Pop that down. Find my weeding tool. Find the corner. Come on, lift up for me. This is the last of this roll. There's only a little tiny piece left, I think. Don't think there's even enough left of this roll to do the next project. Although I just save the transfer tape and I use it. Some things it's better if it's not as tacky. Other things it needs to be. Oh, come on, lift off. Why, why, why? Just because I'm doing this with an audience. If I was on my own, it would lift off really quickly. Okay. Now, pop that there, pop that there. Just to help my eye, I'm just going to try and line up. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Uh-uh. No, not perfect. Oh, there's a bubble in there. Does it really matter? No, probably not. Okay. Burnish on the front. Burnish on the back. Burnish on the back after you stuck it down to your mat cap. Brilliant. Just makes it easier to get it off. My scraper. Okay. Taking, peeling, peeling carefully. The back. Nope. That top bit didn't stick. Try from this side then. Did this work? Yes. Okay. Peeling, can you see me peeling? I can't, can't seem to uh, watch the camera and watch what I'm doing. I need to learn to multitask when making videos, don't I? Oh, lift up. That's it. Uh, oh, 
what is in the wallet? The weighting tool is brilliant. Got a little hook on the end for picking up little bits. Okay. Cut down on an angle. Oh, this blue vinyl doesn't want to weed tonight. It's usually really good, which is why I use so much of it. Because it makes my life easy. And the thing that makes our lives easier is a good thing. Come on, stick, stick, stick. And the lift. Okay. Now we're cooking with gas. Um, yes. Nope. I'm going to lose a bit of that by. Nope. Still going to lose a bit of that by. That one's right. That one's right. Yay. Team. Didn't think that was going to come off. All right. Create something new every day. Now, I am just going to eyeball where it's going to sit before I actually press it down. And, no. transfer tapes ripping that's no good okay oh here we go didn't have an older piece big enough but an older piece would have been well and truly off by now everything safely in its place but because it's new it's sticky and I didn't think to put it on the floor and give it a couple of um taps or taps over my sleeve did I oh well I was too excited to um finally Finally, finally, get this onto the front of his book. It's been here for a long time, waiting to be done. It seems like there's always something to be done, isn't there? Okay. Here we go. Okay. going to destroy this piece of transfer tape because oh, oh, oh there was a piece oh, goodness gracious me thank goodness for weeding tools weed things around and we don't want to have to do some 
surgery, some vinyl surgery. Go down. I might need to go down. going to be a problem, isn't it? Well, this is real life, folks. This happens. This is really happening in my craft room as you are watching. This is what my life is like. You just never know. Ooh. Okay. Lucky that was the last of that transfer tape because it's going in the bin. Just one last little piece to get off up here. And I'm happy with this. I will be when I get this off. Ta da! At last! All right. Create something new every day. Go that. I keep the backings because they can often be handy for um, burnishing over the top, like this, for instance. Just to make sure everything really is stuck down. Okay, two down. How long have we been going? I have no idea. All right. Number three. Number three is for me. Number three is for me. Again, this is something that's been sitting here since um, back to school sales. It's um, an expanding file. And I'll take, and it did come from Kmart. And I chose it because it was a really pretty colour. There we go, take the label off. Um, I want to use it for my card recipes. And you might be saying, if you're not a card maker, you'll be going, what is a card recipe? Card recipe is simply the um, materials and steps to make a card. And all it says is card recipes, but I need to do some weeding. I didn't finish all the weeding, did I? Oops. Maybe that's why this is still here. Okay, out comes that. And out comes... Oh, no. Again, it's another really fine font. Um, they look so pretty, but gosh, they're... Uh, don't like being weeded and they don't always cut nicely either the finer fault fonts but anyway this was a scan and cut font that I just um, did on the machine one of the things I really like about the scan and cut is I can just make something on the fly turn the machine on go into fonts type out my word choose the size position it and cut it it's really easy i love it and we actually chose the scan and cut because we can do just what the name says all right i don't have a piece of transfer okay. okay i do but I am going to do this in pieces. Okay. So we'll do to there. And then it needs to be Wrong way, okay? Think, think, think. Cut it there. Okay. I'll do this in three sections because it's a long one. Okay, cut. 
Botheration. Go down. It'll teach me for being clever, won't it? Trying to do it all in one thing. as it went on. I'm always hesitant to put too much pressure on the finer fonts because they tend to tear. I really like them. But they do tend to tear if I'm not very careful. Uh, like that. And I don't want it to tear. I want it to stick. And it's a nice smooth front on this folder too. So it should stick just fine. surgery will be required. That's okay. Maybe not. Huh, oh, that actually looks quite good. Okay. folder I'm trying to get my card making things organized because they just are everywhere and I don't want them to be everywhere I want them to be nice and neat and tidy in here or my plan is for them to stay in here until I've tried it and decided whether or not I like it if I like it I'll keep it if I don't 
I'll get rid of it, much like you do in the ordinary recipe. Don't stick back down there. Okay, let's try that this way for a change. Can't see what I'm doing. Don't want to get my head in the camera. That's what I don't want to do. Get my head in the camera. That's the last thing you need to be watching, isn't it? My big head. Maybe it's punishment for being so excited that the um, rose gold went on so easily that these two have been difficult. I'm sort of dreading the next one to get going to be trickier too. How do we persevere? I'm a crafter. I am strong. Oh All right. To make it easier so I'm not fighting with that. That can go. Where's the piece of... There we go. That can go on there. Oh, strong grip. <laughs> I'm going to try from this end and see how we go down here, shall we? Hannah's going to watch this and crack up laughing. She's like, Mum, whatever were you doing? And I'm like, Hannah, tearing my hair out. It's just not doing what it's supposed to be doing. Okay. Beautiful. Just lie down there. I'll weed you up in a minute. There we go. Gosh. Where are my bright ideas, guys? If this video ever sees the light of day. Maybe I will. I could I could pretend it's not happening. I'm just not the video couldn't I because seriously as it's recorded nobody would know but me but this is my life this is my life life in the craft room is like it is chaos it is transfer tape that jolly well transfer final that won't unstick there we go goodness me this is ridiculous i am gosh, i am determined to get this done tonight i've been waiting since when did the back to school sales sales start boxing day New Year's Day, something like that. This has been sitting in the cupboard with the label done, waiting patiently for me to say, okay, let's just stick it down. And now I'm saying let's just stick it down. It doesn't want to stick. Oh, we 
I've got ah, oh, we've got recipes down, guys. Recipes is down. Okay. There's little bits of very annoying, but they do come in handy. For little tiny weeding projects. Okay. surgery. The lesson here for me is do not use, do not, do not use fine fonts. I do like them, they do look so nice. They really do look so much better. Can you see what I'm doing? I'm, sorry, guys. Down, we will be done. Dare I bother to put the um, little embellishment on it? Might be too scared after, after all of this because it's even finer. I'll think about it while I'm doing battle. Uh, it's going to be a bit of a pest. All right. Now, let me just, with my handy dandy weeding tool, straighten that out now. A little bit of final surgery required. Put that 
see. Set it down here. And it tries to go and match back up there. All right. Let me see. Not even scented. Oh, it's mine. Three. Uh, uh, uh. It is. Just looks like it's not. Okay. I take it back. Now I've still got these little things, but you know what? This is what we're going to do. We're going to use our fingers. We are not going to bother. Yeah, transfer tape. I'm just going to pop them on with my fingers. You know you wish they were there like that. So lay it down. Where's the other one? Because there is no way no. I'm going to go through that again. Not for this project. Anyway, which sort of makes me a bit nervous because the next one is sort of the same. All right, card recipes. This one's for me. Oh, two for me tonight. Oh, that's good. All right. Three down. Let me clean up some of this. Um... Let me clean up some of this mess now. What do I want to do next? Good question. What do I want to do next? I've got this to do. It's going to be tricky because I'm sort of hmm, cheating a bit. This is actually, this is to go on a bottle, a pump bottle. But it's actually iron-on vinyl. But I can't iron it onto the bottle. So I'm going to cheat. And just give me a moment because I didn't get the glue out. Where is it? Handy, handy. Where is it? Handy, dandy spray adhesive. I am going to cheat again. Where's the bottle? This is the bottle. Um, can you see? This is the bottle. It's a pump bottle, Bathworks, and it came from the two dollar shop. So I'll take all this off because we don't need this. There we go. And this is for uh, hand wash. And if I can get the lid back on, there we go. All right. That's still wet, so let's give it a bit of a warm. See how it's going. All right. Put that there to let it dry. Now, with this, because it's the iron on vinyl, I am going to cheat. And I have my handy dandy spray adhesive here. And I'm going to put that there like that. And I'm going to very gently, if I can, give it a spray with some glue because I can't iron it. Now, I don't know whether this is going to work or not. And luckily, we've got a few weeks before I need to give this to someone. My hands are all covered in glue. I've wiped this bottle, haven't I? I'll do it another, give it another wipe. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. All right. Okay. Give it a second to dry alcohol, so it should dry pretty quickly. Now, where's the tweezers? 
it shouldn't have stuck to the craft mat. Now I'm going to have to tilt it down so I can see what I'm doing. And, huh. I wonder if it's going to stick or not. Did it get enough glue? Top bit didn't get enough. Alrighty. Easy. Easy. Lemon squeezy. Let's try it again. Um, there you go. I'll be more generous. You can see the glue now. Surely there's enough on it now. Um, I sprayed it on the silicon mat because it will wash off. To my scissors, not to my tweezers, but just stick to the grass. There's a little bit of glue in there. I have no idea whether this will work or not. It was just a because it's so the vinyl is so pretty that I really wanted to use it on this bottle. As long as I can put it up the right way, up the right way. Anyway, we'll see. Ouch. Stuck to my fingers. Um, times like these, I think, oh, one of those mug press things would be just great, but it might work it might work can you see can you see it am i holding it where am i holding it i don't know where i'm holding it can you see i'm going the wrong way sorry guys everything's backwards to me um i thought that would look so pretty all right i'll give it a minute to dry try and get where's the alcohol white silicon craft sheet it <laughs> cleans up really well if you don't have one of these for gluing they are brilliant little things kind of got me this um, brilliant little things that will go in a sink of hot water and wash up beautifully all right glue so that's one two three four down now i have another bottle to do it's hiding over here just a pump bottle and where is it same same um same transfer on it i've just dropped it i don't know where i dropped it though Did i drop it here it is okay only in white um this one's just regular vinyl so i will use some transfer tape on it and I will give it a really good wipe because this one has been sitting on the bookshelf for oh, two years. Amber glass soap pump and it is from Kmart and it was about, I think, $2 till it's 50 or something when I bought it. I have had it for a very long time. Okay, here's the same little... Um, like that. So let's get some dandy scissors and trim it off because I don't like that. It's not going to stick. It's better. Okay. Um, have I got? What did I do with that old transfer tape? I don't want to use new transfer tape. Where did I put it? I might just put it on my sleeve a few times. Okay. All right, here we go. Um, terrible trouble finding a corner of this particular brand of transfer tape. Um, Oh, 
that, that's all right. There we go. Found it. All right, I'm just going to rip that across my sleeve a few times to unstickify it. Can you see what I'm doing? A bit of luck. It'll work better. Okay. Over the top of the... I can't believe how much trouble I've had with these tonight. I've been doing this for two and a half years. I do it all the time. Make labels and do all sorts of things with the scan and cut. Love, 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 love it. And the trouble we've had tonight is unbelievable. Okay. Ta-da! There we go. Bottle's dry. And it's going to go. Let me see. Circle so it doesn't really. Rather than that scraper, to burnish it down. And then let's see. been doing glass bottles for uh, months and never had this much trouble even with this same um, transfer never had this much trouble why won't they stick stick to everything else they just won't stick to oh. And it should because it's permanent vinyl. It should be sticking to anything and everything. should actually bother with this craft along because <laughs> you're not getting to see much fun stuff are you all we're doing is sticks I've done heaps of them all year I've been doing them all year I've been doing them and using them for gifts I gave some um, for a raffle I wonder if it's a bottle really good and half of it's a nightmare oh well we will persevere because it's permanent vinyl and it should stick to this bottle I say so <gasps> come on don't rip on me just come off there we go right was it worth the effort, do you think? That's the, the 
W is a bit skew with. So let's try and unskew with him. Now it decides to stick. Now it decides to stick, people. That's better. One bubble that needs to be fixed. the look of it but um not sure why this decided it wasn't going to lay down properly so there's two we've got that one and we've got oh yes it is sticking beautiful okay this one which i think this is really pretty this is very very pretty i need to clean the i'll give it um overnight to dry and then I will um, then I will um, clean it up. Oh, didn't stick you down very well. Okay, done and done. Now, okay. Now I'm really nervous to do this one. This is an, another one for the craft room, but. Right. Says so these are a few of my favourite things, and I got this idea of um, a cricket channel. Shh, don't tell Scan and Cut, don't tell Brother. Um, but I had this organizer. It's a Lazy Susan type organizer, and I had it. Um, in in my shed because I bought it when we renovated the kitchen thinking that I'd use it for something because you know lazy Susans were all the rage well no I hate it so I'm going to wipe it and hope that it dries actually is that all gluey um, I have a bottle of elk of um, rubbing alcohol somewhere, but tonight I'm using up these because they're hanging around the craft room. They can be used up. So let's clean that off nicely so it's all nice and clean. And while that's drying, I'll pop that back under there to get moist. Get rid of some of this stuff that we don't need. Any more tidy up? All right. These are a few of my favourite things. It's a very pretty um, metallic permanent. There you go. It's a cricket vinyl. It must have been on sale when I bought it. Only buy the vinyls on sale. Right. So very expensive otherwise. All right, now, same deal with this. I just do not want, um, I'm very nervous now. Right, um, right uh, where is it? At the corner. Should be an end somewhere. This 
this is a new piece too. So I will do the same de-stickifying. So I am just very nervous now. I cannot believe. Uh, I tried on my arm, but my luck to stick permanently. Just um, right. Just need it to lift off so that I can get this to lie down here. So. Skinny fonts do not work, do they? Okay. Right. After this, I've got one more, and it should be an easy one. Huh? No, didn't stick to the transfer tape. Gosh. Tape. I might have to give up on this and make it a thicker font. I don't really want to. Oh, I do have trouble with my. Uh, no, okay. You know what? I am going to give up on this. I will do this in another show if I ever do this again because I. I think it's going to stick to the transfer tape. The only other thing I can do is, after all that, try this. I have a new roll because I am, huh, after, I've had this in the cupboard for ages, waiting, waiting, waiting to, um, where's the same? Waiting, 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 waiting to um, be able to use it. Because the other roll has lasted forever just about because we do just reuse it. I don't know that. I'm not going to. I will try this. There'll be some tape on here somewhere. I should have used coloured tape. Would it not be so much easier to find the end if they just used colour? Colored tape. Pop that there. Okay. It has to be one, one, two, three, four down. Okay. Uh, bigger scissors would do. Get those. One, two, three, four down. And then across. If it doesn't work this time, guys, I'm giving up and we will try again another time. I'm starting to get tired. It's been a really busy week and we it's been a bit of a stressful week too um, with different things going on. Now I've got to get the end of this, which should be easy to get. Mm -hmm. Says she, it should be easy to get. Oh, come on, give me a break. Just one, just one, just pick it up, just pick it up. There we go. And it just will not separate. There we go. We have, oh, this is going to be awful, it's going to tear. Up, up. Here we go. Okay, I am not de stickifying this one. All right, we will try, try it with you, but I am dreading it. Already I'm dreading it. How's that? I'm not looking forward to it. I'm not actually going to push it down quite so hard either. Let's 
as I should. Because it does that. When it comes off, backing sheet just does not want to come off. And it is such a pretty colour. Okay, nope. I will do some research as to why this is not sticking to the transfer tape. Not even trying to stick to the transfer tape. Okay, that is a wash. Luckily, it's for me. We do not need to panic about it. Uh, that's good enough. I need to stick that back on. Okay, so let's get rid of that. It can go in the figure it out over the weekend when I've got spare time bin. Okay, the next one is easy peasy. She says. And you'll be going, but you said that about everything, and look what's happened. It's okay. This one had this cute little bag. Um, $2 shop. Our local $2 shop. Oh, no. Rookie mistake. I printed the transfer, but I didn't mirror it so that, oh, my giddy aunt. Well, all right. Let's see. What can we do instead? Nothing. I need to go and do that. So I'm going to call it a night because I'm absolutely exhausted. And it is, oh, it's nearly 9.30 at night. Which is a late night for me, guys. I know Tuesday nights we do our lives. I talk a lot and and seem to stay on and chat, chat, chat. But oh my gosh, this tonight's really done me in. But anyway, I'm thrilled to bits with my little uh, trolley coin purse. I'm glad I persevered with the card recipes folder. I'm really excited to get this finally finished so that it can get wrapped with the other things it goes with. I am loving, love, 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 loving this. And this one, well, I absolutely, I do. I think it's beautiful and it will look so pretty when it's full of um, hand wash. So this is how craft in my craft room goes. Never a dull moment. More hits than miss, uh, hits and miss, more misses than hits. But we get stuff done. So if you've stuck with me this far, thank you. If you think this was worthwhile. <laughs> watching and you'd like to see this sort of thing again um let me know i'd be more than happy to um do more of them if you think they're worthwhile in the meantime i'm going to turn out the lights turn the computer off turn out the lights and go to bed i'll see you next time